our group, quite a few of us have been using the Zack Speed backpacks over the past five years. Two key features of the brand are the ability to mix and match accessories and the broad range. Mixing and matching, you can set it up for camera mounts, toolkits or a vest for extra storage. And the range? This goes from small competition packs to big adventure style setups. The Sprint is the usual option for dirt riding. I've been using that for five years now. Two of our guys like to carry lots of gear and chose the Recon and Dakar models. But two years ago they released a small backpack called the Comp 3 that is a smaller system geared toward racing. And it was interesting to see that Tim Coleman had a lot of input into the design. In our group, Ben and Arch are getting into the regular hard enduro events, so they wanted something small and compact. My brother and I have got the same backpack, but for different reasons. We wanted something lighter and smaller for hot summer conditions, but still with the three litre capacity. After two years of abuse, here is our review. It's all good quality. So far, all four of us have had zero issues. At first, I was worried about the zip failing. It's not a heavy duty zip like the bigger backpacks, but none has failed to date. I checked the feedback section of Zach Speed's Facebook page and it's five out of five stars on all the feedback so far. I googled around for complaints too, I couldn't find any. If you have had any issues with your Zach Speed gear, let us know in the comments. Being a race pack, storage is very minimal of course. There is just enough room for a wallet or phone. Maybe both if you don't fill the bladder completely. If you want more storage, you need to go to the bigger Recon backpack or add the tool pack option. Excellent quality water bladder and mouthpiece. There are measurements on the bladder if you want to see how much water you have used. The quick release for the hose is a nice touch. The straps, all great quality and padded. There's also an elastic waistband, which I don't use. We simply don't ride fast enough to have the backpack bouncing around. The padding is ribbed for his pleasure. Or more accurately, it lets air move through for more ventilation. Great for summer riding. I checked the website and there is now also a smaller, cheaper 2 litre version of this pack called the Comp 2. Any criticism? I am pushing hard to find any negative points. I know this backpack is set up for racing, but possibly it would be good if the storage pouch was just a bit bigger in case you wanted to put more things in. But of course, you would also need to then carry slightly less water to make room. In the bigger backpacks, the hose is covered, which I actually like. There's less chance of slime slowly growing in the tube when it's exposed to sunlight. Obviously, Zach Speed has gone all out to make the backpack super light, but I am tempted to find a cover for the hose. Finally, while the backpack is designed in Australia, it is manufactured in China. I know increasingly some riders are avoiding Chinese-made gear, but when it comes to backpacks, it's almost impossible nowadays. And the overall quality is excellent, so the Zack Speed guys have obviously been pushing hard for good quality control. Interested in the bigger Recon backpack? See our review from a few years back.